Okay, I'm going to be uh, quick about our last presentation, which general field. Basically, uh, these two is almost the same. Uh, the difference is when you create the general one, the ind independent table, not uh, CCK type uh, content type but instead it will be CCK item table name ok let me uh, show you ok to general we set uh, the padlock to off like this and we create a new field Okay, for example, we save a uh, general heel. We use a standard article, but we create uh, another text, for example. Mm, sorry, another uh, field, for example. Mm, tagging. Okay, we save. and we refresh okay let's okay this is the new general field we input here to the storage mastery content type okay and then we save We refresh here. Okay, this is general type of field type. Okay, save. Okay, let's see on the Joomla table that refresh it will create a new independent table but this one for exclusive this one for general and when we see the structure let's see for okay this is tagging and the one that we just create Okay, what taking inside is this is general type or field type. Okay, and the CCK this is for uh, same blood usage. Okay, this is the field that we just create here. Okay. Another thing that interests is if we create okay a uh, new field. Okay, we make it general first. Okay, create add field. <coughs> uh, 
okay this is let's say we call outer field okay we use standard the same standard okay let's name it outer field and we check the outer and we choose the variable let's say we use far char for example art field alter what interested in what what interesting is it will okay let's see the database it will add a new field in the Joomla core table Okay, as you see, this one is not the default Joomla. We just create. Okay, let's refresh. Okay, this outer field. Let assign. Okay, and then we save. Okay, after that, uh, we are refresh. Okay, let's save. So let's see what happened on the database. Uh, we open just content here. The same hello world, and it create a new field. And the good thing about Sablot 2.0 that okay, this is the last part okay let's unlock first and we add field we can alter the table on almost all okay let's see almost all Joomla uh, table yeah for example if we would like to alter the Joomla okay let's say for banner let's say for example uh, we create format standard free okay this is banner banner uh, save data custom data we get standard we use free okay with banner let's say this is custom data and we alter it okay this is general what happened is if you open the banner database the banner table I mean it create new custom data directly from Sablon so you can imagine the possibility is very very limitless with Sablon 2.0 you can almost alter anything in Sablon 2.0 so uh, this finished the presentation uh, hope you enjoy it. Okay, this modify color variable. Yes, 
this this is all the presentation thank you for watching and i see you in the next presentation have a nice day